Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In today's video, we have one very interesting question from exponential equations. 5 power 2x plus 2 over 5 power x plus 2 minus 1 plus 1 over 5 power x plus 1 minus 2 equal to 1 over 5 power x plus 1 minus 3. And we are going to calculate real solutions only. So let's get started this video by considering our denominators. It cannot be 0. So if I will write 5 power x plus 2, it should not be equal to 1. That means x plus 2 should not be equal to 0. x should not be equal to negative 2. Exempted solutions. Second denominator 5 power x plus 1 equal to 2. It should not be. Take log both sides. So I will write x plus 1 should not be equal to log 2 base 5. So x cannot be equal to negative 1 plus log 2 with base 5. Similarly, I will write for the third denominator minus 1 plus log 3 base 5. Now our equation I will consider as 5 power 2x plus 2. I can write our equation as 5 power 2 times x plus 1 in the bracket. Denominator 5 power x plus 1 plus 1 minus 1 plus 1 over 5 power x plus 1 minus 2 equal to 1 over 5 power x plus 1 minus 3. Now I will write two properties from exponents. So first property which I will write here a power b plus c. Any time we can write a power b times a power c which I will apply here in the denominator. Now for the numerator, I will use this exponent property a power b times c. I will write a power c whole power b. Let's apply. So numerator I will be writing 5 power x plus 1 whole square using this property divided by using first property. I will write 5 times 5 power 1 it is. So 5 times 5 power x plus 1 minus 1 plus 1 over 5 power x plus 1 minus 2 equal to 1 over 5 power x plus 1 minus 3. Now it is clearly visible 5 power x plus 1 will be our substitution. So let's write here. I will consider let 5 power x plus 1. Suppose this is a and a must be greater than 0. As it is exponential function. So our equation will become in a, a square over 5a minus 1 plus 1 over a minus 2 equal to 1 over a minus 3. Now I will take this term to the RHS. So a square over 5a minus 1 will be equal to 1 over a minus 3 minus 1 over a minus 2. Let's take LCM in the RHS a minus 3 times a minus 2. Now cross multiply I will be writing a minus 2 minus a plus 3 minus a plus a will be over numerator will be 1 only. 1 divided by a minus 2 times a minus 3. LHS is a square over 5a minus 1. Now I will cross multiply. So I will be writing a square times a minus 2 times a minus 3 
let me write and rhs i will be writing 5a minus 1 let's multiply i will write a square this bracket will give us a square minus 3a minus 2a minus 5a plus 6 rhs will be unchanged now i can write a power 4 minus 5a cube plus 6a square minus 5a plus 1 equal to 0. Now we know that a is always greater than 0. So that means a is non-zero. So I can divide both sides by a square. So let's divide. I will write here divided by a square. This side also divided by a square. Now I will write our equation as a power 4 over a square a square 5a cube over a square 5a plus 6 minus 5 over a plus 1 over a square rhs is 0 now first term and last term i will write like this plus or better is to write minus 5 common a plus 1 over a plus 6 equal to 0. Now I will split this 6 as 2 plus 4. So I will take this 2 here with the first two terms. So I will be writing a square plus 1 over a square plus 2. Then I will write minus 5 times a plus 1 over a as it is. Then here I will be writing 4 only equal to 0. Now see the first bracket is it is a plus 1 over a whole square. So this will become one quadratic equation in a plus 1 over a. So I can write this equation as a plus 1 over a whole square minus 5 a plus 1 over a plus 4 equal to 0. Now this is one quadratic equation in a plus 1 over a. So let us calculate a plus 1 over a using quadratic formula. Minus b. So this time minus of minus 5 plus minus the square root of b square to minus 5 square minus 4ac 4 times 1 times c is 4 divided by 2a so 2 times 1 so i can write here 5 plus minus the square root 25 minus 16 divided by 2 5 plus minus this is square root 9 so 3 divided by 2 5 plus 3 is 8. 8 over 2 is 4. 5 minus 3 is 2. 2 over 2 is 1. So we have a plus 1 over a values. So I will be writing here a plus 1 over a equal to 1. One reciprocal equation a plus 1 over a equal to 4. Now we have to solve these two equations. Let's solve. So I will write a plus 1 over a equal to 1, first equation. And second equation is a plus 1 over a equal to 4. Remember, a was our substitution. 5 power, let me write here, x plus 1. Now, a is non zero. Multiply this equation with a. So I will be writing a square plus 1 equal to a or a square minus a plus 1 equal to 0. Let me check discriminant only. b square, so minus 1 a square minus 4 ac, 4 times 1 times 1. So this is 1 minus 4 which is minus 3. 
discriminant is negative complex solutions will be there complex solutions so rejected now we have this second equation again a is non zero so i can multiply both sides by a a square plus 1 equal to 4a a square minus 4a plus 1 equal to 0 let's apply quadratic formula a equal to minus b so 4 plus minus under the root b square 16 minus 4ac minus 4 divided by 2 4 plus minus root 12 2 root 3 divided by 2 so i can write 2 plus minus root 3 this is our a and a was our substitution 5 power x plus 1 let's write so i will write a equal to 5 power x plus 1 equal to 2 plus minus root 3 important point is both values are greater than 0 2 plus root 3 of course it is positive 2 minus root 3 it is positive 2 minus 1.732 now i will consider log both sides so i will write log 5 power x plus 1 equal to log 2 plus minus root 3 one time we can take plus sign another time we can write minus sign now i will use log property log a power b this b will come as a multiplier which will give us b log a let's apply so i will take this x plus 1 as a multiplier so x plus 1 times log 5 equal to log 2 plus minus root 3 divide both sides by log 5 x plus 1 this will become log 2 plus minus root 3 divided by log 5 which we can write in the base so i will write 2 plus minus root 3 with base 5 using log property now target is x so i will take away 1 from both sides so x will become minus 1 plus log 2 plus minus root 3 with base 5 and you can check from the rejected list it is not matching with any value so we have got two real solutions for this exponential challenge and this brings the end of this video thank you friends for watching do not forget to like share subscribe bye bye till next video good luck take care bye bye